the GFA um, Ghana Premier League playoff game or the playoffs. And remember, three teams are in the gunning or the running to um, qualify for the Ghana Premier League. Ashanti Gold were demoted or they have been demoted into Division 2 uh, for match fixing. So it's between Liberty, Ebusua Dwarfs, and Tamale Cities. These are the results. So Liberty played their opening game. They beat Ebusua Dwarfs by three goals to one. Um, then in their second game, had they beaten Tamale Cities, it would have been qualification for um, Liberty. But they lost that game. And now the decider will be between uh, Tamale City and Ebusua Dwarfs. Now it's on a league basis. So as it stands, yeah. Yeah, so we can show you the, the league table now. So as it stands, Liberty are still on top with three points. Tamale City, by virtue of beating Liberty, are second. So if Ebusua Dwarfs beats Tamale Cities, that's where it could get tricky. Yeah. Because now all teams will be on three points. And I think to go to head-to-head, -head, then probably, go defense. Probably, go, probably do go defense first yeah, if I'm Liberty sure. are yeah. top right now. Exactly, but, so head-to-head. But, 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 but again, look, this thing, eh, Ghana, the people running our football, Granted, personally, I've got serious issues with them. What, what are the issues with this? The issues here is that there's no way uh -huh. that Tamale City should be part of this playoff. Why? Ah, they are from a different zone. Uh -huh. They had the opportunity in that zone to qualify. They didn't qualify. They don't come from the same zone as Ashgold. They don't. No, but coach, you see, the thing is, Ashgold, okay. and at the time of that Ashgold inter-allied problem, uh -huh. They were not affected in any way. Mm -hmm. To be honest, the two affected teams, in my view, was Ebushan Duaf and Liberty Professional. Mm -hmm. So if anything at all, it should have been a straight one game between Liberty and Ebushan Duaf. Whoever wins it goes and replaces Ashcode. That is what it should have been. Like when you go and bring in somebody, who was not affected by the actions of Ashgold at the time. And you go and pick the person from a different zone. There are so many things that we need to talk about here. Yeah, see, I mean, my only conclusion is that it's because of votes. Somebody has promised somebody. Coach, I don't think so. Oh. I don't think so. No, you see, because the explanation is simple. What is the explanation? The match-fixing scandal between Ashgold and Inter-Allies uh -huh. is not the reason why Liberty and Ebusura Dwarfs went down. Okay. Liberty and Ebusura Dwarfs went down because in the league they were part of the bottom three. That's, That's settled. It. That's what happened between Ashgold and Inter Allies has nothing to do with it. Uh -huh. Why have the three, the second place teams in all the three zones been uh -huh. brought back? Because by in terms of rankings, they they, they were second based in or second placed in all the three zones. Whether Ashgold are in Tamale City zone or not, it doesn't matter. Because as I said, Ashgold's actions should so, not be directly so advantageous right now, or disadvantageous so, so, to anybody in their zone. So can right I, can now, I say something? Uh -huh. I understand where Coach is coming from because the season that Ebusia Dwarfs and Liberty were relegated mm -hmm. was tainted by Ashgold's actions. I exactly. think that's where he's going. No, I but I think the GFA has decided that because that season was finished, we stood with those results. We went with it. It's not, it doesn't matter. So we are going to go based we on the fact that it. we need an extra we team Then Ashgo should be reinstated. No. Because at the end of the day, it is that action that has caused the relegation no, of Ashgo. I think, Coach, so that, that, that league it. table, they left it as it is. They did another league season. And now, because the judgment came out after, if the judgment had come out, I think, right after that season ended, it would have been made, it would have made sense for Liberty and Dwarves to play or to keep the person who was, was it, is it 16th? The person who, like, was last oh, see, the, I don't know if, if I'm see, Even that, you see, it, it, it all comes down to uh, statutes. The GFA can deem it. The ESCO has it in their power. That is where the pro, see, no, that no, is where see, the issue is. Coach, let's the ESCO has coach, let's given unto themselves, or the people in football, they've given unto themselves. Oh, because see, this powers is important. That allows this, them these to loopholes, decisions. These loopholes are not captured in the statutes, which makes I, sense I for would, the ESCO to sit down, relax. For the ESCO to sit down and find a feasible way to get in somebody fit. It is like saying that. And I gave this example of football made in Ghana. It is like saying that in this company, at, at the end of every year, after a review, they sack the three le less performing uh, pe 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 yes, employees. Persons. Then they sack the employees. Then two months into the following year, somebody is sacked for stealing. And you are saying that we should bring back 
the person, your last person who was sacked. No, no. You at were the end sacked. Of the relax. Day. You were sacked because you were underperforming. At the, at the other at person's actions has nothing to do with you. So it's down to management no, no, no. to decide who no, take no, no. your place. No, no, no. It is not that you went down because you were relegated no, 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 and somebody no, no. else has been taken out because no, of no, no. something that has nothing to do with performance. No, no, no. It doesn't work like that. Even, even here, if you are to sack the three, let's say. Uh, least, performing, least yeah. performing employees. They all can never come up with the same percentage. Maybe they'll say, if you fall below 50, yes. you are sacked. But below the 50, Sasu here will be, will be scoring something 37. I'll be scoring something 45. Maybe you 49. Yes. We've all fell below 50. But my 49, so, I can't come 49, and say... You are better than me. Yes, but I can't that, come and say, City should take me back. No, City should rather say... the person who was sacked no, no, no. stealing. No, C City should rather say, you... No, because of the three least sack, you are the one with the most percentage. No, the bottom line is is because of what you cannot say. No you can't say that. No, you can't say that. There's some that. sense in what they've done. Because you can't see that. There's as a lot they, of sense in what they've done. They 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 the because they. they've relegated three teams this year. Uh, they've promoted three teams. Uh -huh. So there's now they've also relegated Ashgood in addition. In addition. Now it's become so, four. So in so, that zone, there's going to be numerical disadvantage. Ashgood. Maybe let's go on. Ash Next time we'll talk about coach it. coach has a point about in that zone, zone thing. numerically, there's, the, that's it's going to affect know, somebody. But I don't think there's anything wrong with this. Going to, it is I don't, I don't think at the end of the day, one, one zone we'll have would, have, would have two promoted teams, which shouldn't be. And in terms of numbers of the next season, that zone will be short of one. And or or they're going to go to the second division and promote. They, they have to promote someone from the second there division. There you go. So they promote from the third two. No, they but that's where Ashgood have gone. So Ashgood have, have there's have another have playoff that is going go. to cater for inter allies demotion. So that will also make sense. So these no people, they, they are not serious. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. <laughs> okay, I don't that's you. I don't but they are not but let's let's go for a commercial break.